Dead the Dog. Welcome back, Crip Crow! Thank you so much for joining me tonight. It means the world to me. Uh, we got an exciting one. This new edition of Dark Reflections. Um, super excited to be here with you guys tonight. We got a new one from our fucking brothers, veterans of this podcast. Um, our second ever guest to ever be on the show, actually, in terms of people that we don't know. You know what I mean? Um... Victims of the system. We are here talking victims of the system tonight. Their brand new EP, which came out June 5th, titled Beheading the Inbred Scum. Um, off Internal Gang Green Records. Uh, this is a six-track EP. Pretty quick in and out, like 13 minutes-ish long, I want to say. Um, and I got to tell you, like, anybody that's been following the show has heard us talk about and to victims of the system many times at this point over the last year. Uh, they've, they've been regulars on the show. And, uh, I tell you what, you know, they are, they are no question. They are a young band. They're, they're made up of young people and it is so awesome and inspiring to see what they're doing, how much work they're putting. They got that fucking hustle. Yo, they got fucking, they released like three, like three or four EPs this year. Probably they were on even more splits than that. They have been dropping shit like fucking crazy. It's absolutely insane. The hustle, um, the dedication, um, how much I've seen them grow over the past year is is really awesome, really inspiring, and I can't wait to see what they do uh, in the future, especially. Um, after this EP, uh, because uh, they, we do have an episode with Aaron from Victims of the System, the guitarist and founder, um, coming out probably within a day or so, where he talks about how after this EP, they're going to kind of change up the direction a little bit. But without further, so everybody keep an eye out for that. But without further ado, let's dive into this six track EP. Now we're going to start off this one with a uh, fucking insane insane like guitar intro it sounds so good like Aaron absolutely brings the thunder on on uh on this one and it really really stands out that intro I, I absolutely love it um and it's kind of like the intro and a little bit of the intro to the first second track paranoia um it's it's just absolutely phenomenal and and I think he acts absolutely fucking really really is able to show off his guitar chops right there and I think that's really fantastic. Um the next two tracks uh what do we got? We got Paranoia, Sadistic Slut Butchering featuring Jonah from Future Defecation, uh fucking unstoppable anger and stab wounds. So like the next like four tracks. This is pretty I'm not going to say it's it's definitely it definitely feels like it has a lot more direction. Uh, but it is also still that disgusting, gnarly, gory, grindy, guttural, like just ripping flesh from bone sound. Super grindy kind of a thing. Really fucking intense. Uh, I absolutely love it. Uh, Aaron did all the mixing and mastering. I think he did a great job. Um, and it, it's, you know, those tracks, those, those four tracks are fucking... Like if the, if if yeah if you just want some of the most violent gnarly shit that yeah it's phenomenal. Jason's vocals stand out. It, everybody did a great fucking job. Now uh, it gets kind of wild when we get to track six. Track six is actually a bonus track called "A Version Prevails Slash uh, Disdained." And it's a bonus track from Jason's solo project, the vocalist of this band. He's got a solo project. And uh, it's titled, it's called Nightwish. I'm not sure if that's the name of his solo project or not. But it is totally different from everything else on the album. It is a very welcome surprise. I thought it was an absolutely incredible song. Um... And, and yeah, I definitely, definitely hope to hear more like this, not just from Jason, but also from victims of the system. I think if they took the band in a direction like this, it they'd really start hitting something. Like, because I think that uh, that would allow Aaron to be uh, uh, to show off his uh, guitar ability a little bit more. Uh, and it, I really, really, really love that track, Jason. If you're seeing this, outstanding work, really blew me away. 
you know, I, I listened to the whole EP and then I got to that and I was like, where is this coming from? This is amazing. Like it's, it's yeah, I, I totally different, totally different, really stands out. Uh, and I think it's really cool that Aaron wanted to throw that on there um, to uh, to get more eyes on Jason's solo project. I think that's really awesome. So shout out to all of them. Um, links in the description below for Victims of the System uh, uh, in Instagram, Internal Gangrene Records Bandcamp, because that's where you'll find a lot of Victims of the System's music. Uh, and if I can find Jason's solo project, I'll put that in the link in the description below as well, because that track is phenomenal. And he is a wonderful vocalist. Really, really awesome. Aaron and him, I think, are going to do some pretty amazing things. And I can't wait to see uh, where they take the sound next. I'm very, very excited. Uh, I, I don't have much more to say on this one, honestly. It's a short EP. Um, I think they fucking killed it. Uh, if you like super heavy, grindy, deathy shit, then you're going to fucking love this. And it's really exciting uh these guys just don't stop and i i I'm, i really enjoy i love having them on the show i love the, I, I can never thank them enough for all the support they've given us they've done some amazing things in terms of support for us it really means the world to me and uh yeah they fucking rule so everybody be sure to check out all things victims of the system and there's a lot more coming from them this year for sure so if you hop on now Mm, you're in for a treat. Uh, but that's going to be about it for this one, everybody. Um, I hope you all enjoyed this EP as much as I did. And uh, we will be back again, as always, very, very soon with much, much more. But until then, raise your fucking horns and bang your goddamn heads to some victims of the system, Bandy and Brett Scum. We love you all to death. We'll be back again very soon. Good night!